Support groups help people to feel less lonely or isolated and learn about coping strategies that can help to manage tinnitus. The BTA is a small organisation based in Sheffield, so we rely on the help of people like you to run local support groups. A support group is used as an umbrella term for any group of people who are meeting to offer each other support with their experience of tinnitus. The BTA and support groups use a federal structure. All this means is that support groups have autonomy over what they do and how they do it. We'll be there to help as and when you need us. Support group organisers do three key things in running a support group. They book the meeting venue, coordinate guest speakers and facilitate the discussions on the day. The role of support group organiser can either be done alone or shared by a few people. The BTA can help you to run a support group in lots of ways, including helping with money to pay for venues and refreshments, publicising the group to make sure you get a good turnout for meetings, suggesting guest speakers to invite along to meetings, providing training in tinnitus and how to facilitate support group conversations. We don't expect you to know too much about tinnitus or have run groups like this before. The main thing is that you are positive about how tinnitus can get better and are willing to welcome new people to the group. Often, the hardest part of running a support group is finding a venue that is cheap or free to use. Support groups meet at hospitals, community centres, church halls, pubs and cafes and libraries. We can help you to find venues in your area if you need our help, but we'd ask you to check them out before the meeting. One of the common questions is when to meet. There is no easy answer to this. It's really up to you and the availability of the venue as to whether you meet in an afternoon, evening or at the weekend. Generally, we'd recommend meeting either every other month or quarterly as this makes running a group much more realistic. It's very difficult to predict how many people will attend the first few support group meetings. Usually, a first meeting gets between 6 to 20 people coming along. At your first meeting, we'd always hope to be there to support you and talk generally about tinnitus and how support groups can help. After the first meeting, we'll be on hand to offer any other support we can from a distance. So, if there's not a support group in your local town or city, why not set one up? Give us a call or send an email and we can talk to you some more about how to get one going.